Oman Chamber of Commerce and Industry, OCCI, held a symposium to discuss the most important provisions of the Chamber's new law, issued by the Royal Decree No. 56 over 2022, and to clarify the most prominent updates and changes brought by the new system. There are a few major changes which has been taking place in this uh, royal degree. The most prominent is there that the members of the uh, board of members has been increased from 15 to 21. And uh, the five has been added from the SOG company from uh, Muscat Security. And one is uh, for the investors. And the balance uh, 15 are five from Muscat and 10 from the region. And other changes which has been taking place is also the members of the board of directors for the region has been reduced from seven to five. Now there will be five and also the highest uh, member he bring the vote, he will be the uh, chairman of that region. And then overall the 21 members uh, from the re uh, overall, they will select their uh, chairman for the Oman uh, Chamber of Commerce. The new law gives OCCI leverage to access and create collaboration and partnerships with other chambers around the world. As the world economy recovering from post-COVID uh, pandemic, I believe this law came at the right time to organize Oman Chamber of Commerce uh, roles and functions. This will open up the horizon for uh, Oman Chamber of Commerce to collaborate with other chambers, to other markets, and give the opportunity for local uh, companies to work more closely uh, with uh, the world uh, uh, various uh, uh, economies. The new legislations endorsed on generating market research that will assist the Sultanate of Oman to attract investments. The new law of Oman Chamber of Commerce and Industry comes at a stage where the private sector will lead a competitive national economy towards achieving the goals of Oman Vision 2040. For the Sultanate of Oman Television, Salih Bakhalfan al-Rahbi, Moscow.